Hello. I don't remember if I even what but the controls were. Is it like a X, right? Yeah, X is confirmed. Cat, are you still there? Ah, I'm awake. I had a dream just now. I saw. You did? Wow, I I really thought I was back home. Oh, the sun back in my home world isn't a light bulb. It's a big ball in the sky. I've read this before. So don't remember what I was doing. I think I was heading into this area, wasn't I? Maybe. I'm functional. Let's see you fix the generator. Can't help me. Nice to meet you, robot. I'm gonna take you somewhere. Can't move because he's too rusty. Find a way, da da da. Yep. All I remember is in the mine, there was like a blue clover thing and some kind of hint, but I don't remember what else. I'm gonna go back to the mine. And then if not, I'm just gonna continue on with what I was, what like I would do if this was my first run through, which is go to the, the foggy area and then um, get the syringe. I remember like my first run through fairly well, but like when it comes to remembering starting new game plus i don't actually remember what i was doing so we had this little guy and then i we needed to like get yeah a glowing journal we need a cart or there is a cart further down but i don't know where to get a cart if not i'll continue but i i mean obviously the journal wants me to go with a cart, right? But, but, I don't know where to find a, a cart. There's one over here. There's one right here, right? It doesn't let me interact with it though. Nico, listen. Nico, look, a cart. Grab it. Ah! I'm so lost. Okay, do I just keep going then? Well, is there anything in here I can use? There's these guys, we know them. Huh, what do I do? I guess I just go north. I know for anyone that's coming in and hasn't seen the rest of my playthrough, is like, why is she going so fast? But listen, I've already seen all this, that's why. Speedrunner now, hi Kthylis. Kind of. I think the sponge or syringe, there was one in here. There's this, rubber gloves. And then, how do we, oh yeah, crowbar to get in here. There we go. Here's the sponge. Where did I get the syringe? Oh, here, 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 here. It was here. It was here. Oh, oh, here, here, here. Here we go. Ha 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 ha. Thinking thoughts. So we have the syringe. We use that on that, but first we need the, uh, Gas from something. Oh, I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember. I remember. Don't need instructions. I know what to do. Bottle with the gas. Yes. Okay. And then we go down to the bubble. <laughs> with this. Boop. We got the acid. Put it on the sponge. Kaboop. And now we have a way to leave this area. But like, am I supposed to? You know? <laughs> the thing that confuses me the most right now is that the mine is telling me, oh yeah, take a cart in there and kaboom, you can go further in the mine or whatever. But I literally can't. Like every cart I've gone up to, I've not been able to get, you know? Have an ability to trace materials for sure. Oh right, she gives me the amber necklace. Yeah, that's what it was. Okay. There we go. Uh, what's it made of? Made of amber. Blah, 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 blah. All right. Now that I have the way out, I'll go back to the mine just to see if there's anything I can do. Uh, so we came here. Glowy journal. Cool, cool. Neat. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, that's some bullshit is what that is. That's some bullshit. What just happened? Some dumb shit. Stupid, stupid. I went up to all of these carts, waving a crowbar and waving my journal at them, being like, hey, work, come with me. 
Nico, drag it. I feel stupid at the moment. <laughs> I was just taking a closer look at the journal and then I found this page that looks like a drawing of this room. When I looked up, this minecart just showed up out of thin air. This looks like a standard issue minecart though, which means it likely detected the motion of this room and sent itself over. Ah, that does make sense. I'm just surprised it still works. Guess that means we'll have a working vehicle now. Not sure why would you, you would want to visit the deeper mines though, but if you want to, we now have that option. Is the minecart even going to fit both of us? No. But I wanted you to come with us. I know I've got cat, but honestly, this place gives me the creeps. Oh, I can still come with. I would just have to follow along on the rails. Doesn't it look a little precarious? The magnetic rails can hold me in place. It's only ever dangerous to walk on it if you're an organic bean. Okay, cool. I'm annoyed if I just went through all that. Just to go into the deeper mines and have it be worth it. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'm in the trash! Alright, let's continue with the game. I do not recognize this place. This isn't what I'm supposed to be showing you at all. How did you get here? I can only think of one person. He contacted you. How long has he been doing this? It doesn't matter at this point. You're going out of bounds. Turn back. Please turn back. Bad things are going to happen. Very bad things. At this rate, Nico will be in danger. Please turn back. Oh, the cart stopped. Looks like this is as far as the tracks go. So, where are we? One of the old observation rooms. Looks like it's still mostly intact. Oh, what? Huh? The terminal just reactivated, but the power was cut off so long ago. Maybe it's run out on run. Blah, 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 blah. Maybe it runs on battery. No, that's not it. Whatever it is, I need to investigate. Will you be okay by yourself for a bit? Don't worry, cat's with me. All right, stay safe. Hmm, interesting, interesting. How's it going? No idea. Looks like these terminals are running on a completely separate power source. I can't really recognize any of the data formats on this terminal either. This is all new, or at least encrypted. I'll need to analyze it through my own system. Might take some time, so you don't need to stay. It's a power cell, I think. Oh, the word profit bot is written on the side. Didn't notice that earlier. Oh. Oh? Recognize the light in your eyes. You're the person I am destined to meet. What is your name? I'm Nico. Do you know who sent you? Oh. Um. N no? Wait. Do you mean who sent me to this world? There was a robot a while back who told me about how I'm the messiah and stuff. So I'm guessing Cat sent me, with them being God and all. The robot looks a little bit like you even. Maybe you know each other? Cannot say. A lot of my memories have been removed for safety reasons. Your memories were removed? That's terrible. Wait, I'm guessing that's uh, less of a big deal for a robot. I'm going to assume you do not know who sent you. How did you get here then? How did you reach this room? We got here in a minecart. But the minecart wasn't there when you entered the mines, was it? Oh, yeah. So how did you find it? I didn't really find it. The robot lady- la la la. <laughs> the robot lady thinks it was just the minecart coming to us, but I remember looking at the journal when it happened. And when I looked up again, the cart was just there. Poof. Just like that. Please, show me this journal. Okay. It's already begun. Um, here. What is that? I am entrusting you with my main memory disk. You have passed the first test by showing me the book. Now you'll need to find a way to install the backup. Install the... Before you do that, though, someone else is with you, right? Someone aside from Cat. A resident of this world. Yeah, the robot lady with the red hair. She's in the computer room right now. Then please do not tell her you found me. At least not yet. I can't be seen like this. Um, okay. Please help me restore my memory. Bring the disc back once you have the backup. Residential tracking machine for reference and explanation of the symbols. Cross. Medical units are assigned to this building. Robot. A robot is assigned to this building. Electricity. A power cell is assigned to this building. Okay. This looks like a puzzle. Haha. <laughs> Profit bot zero backup system 1.0. Oh. Please insert disk. Yep, that's a computer. All right. 
Error. Backup request denied. What? Dormitory assignments are not up to date. Please confirm the residential tracking machine to continue. Okay then. Alright, so that has to do with this. <sighs> 110, 112, 113. 117, 118, 119. Anything on your end? How's it going? This observation room isn't for the mines. I've actually never been into this particular one. You recognize it at first though. They all look the same. Fair enough. I did find something interesting though. All the databases seem to encode video feeds. Right now, I can see various places in the barrens. The outposts, the residential areas, even my own house. They're all shot from a top-down perspective too, which means the cameras would have to be in the air. But I've never seen any cameras around. That's kind of spooky. I might go investigate later. Did you find anything interesting in the back room? You were in there a while. Yeah, we found a dead end. I see. All right. So we need, this is gonna be a top down and I need to know which type of robot or generator or whatever lives in each I'll be back okay so this is this is oh it says the numbers on them oh that makes everything so much easier okay all right so uh, I'm gonna get out uh, pen and paper all right so this is 110 what do we got in 110 so I'm gonna think, um, robots for this one, I guess, because there's no power generator here. This should be the next building, right? Yeah, 112. I think taught in school. Yeah, this is, I think, just robots again. So, this has a power generator in it. Yep. I remember that. Uh, I'm gonna make a big, do the robot voice. Ah, oh, yeah, this is the one with the guy in it. So this one is also robots. Uh, so this is also robots. We should just have one more. Yep, 117, which is also robots, I think. All right, so 110 is robots. 112 is medical. Well, 113 is robots. 19 is power. Ta-da! Answer disc. Alright, let's see. Ah, okay. I know for a fact one of these had a live robot in it. Although, I wonder... Most of them just didn't have any robots in it, right? There was one robot. Let's see if that works. We'll just go back. This one does not. This one is medical. This one has robots. This one does not. Da da! Yay! Okay, cool. Now we can put in the disc. Woo! Preparing backup, writing to disc, 26% complete, 34% complete, 40% complete, 100% complete, ejecting disc. Hooray! Does this work? Rebooting. Are you okay? Sure. So I guess it worked? I believe a proper introduction is in order. I am the prototype originally named ProfitBot. I was built to greet the savior of the old world. Wait, a profit robot like that one I met? Hey, I was right about you guys looking alike. Well, the profit bot out there now is a gross simplification of my design. That is to say, he is much more primitive by comparison. Embarrassingly so. Hey, he seemed alright to me. You don't understand. Not only is he not tamed, he was tailor-made for this much smaller, simpler world to begin with. I was not. I was built before the real world ended. The real world? Oh, right. You didn't know. Nico, do you remember the ending? Excuse me? The fact that you found me at all means this is not your first time in this world. You have already been summoned to this world once before. In fact, you've already traversed the entire world and went through the tower already. And in the ending, you either put in the sun or you didn't. What matters is that you're here now. Cat has successfully bypassed the one-shot restriction and brought you back again. I thought something was weird. When I woke up at the house, I called out a name. It turned out to be Cat's name. And then I... 
back at the other robot. I even asked Cat if we met before. Felt like such a dumb question at the time. It looks like you're at least aware of it. I don't actually remember going through the world. I just remember Cat. Look, just like how my memories were locked away, yours are too. You're a living being. You don't even need extra hardware to remember. Just close your eyes and focus. Focus on what? Try to picture a big room made entirely of glass. No matter what you saw in the tower, the top room never changes. Whoa. 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 No way. I was there, wasn't I? At the tower. I've been through the tower. It doesn't make sense. If I already finished the mission, why didn't anything change? The other prophet bought the robot lady. None of them remember who I am. Of course not. The residents do not have that capacity. NPC memories do not last beyond the scope of a session. You know, the characters. The world's residents. All their past memories are built into their code, but the characters themselves don't really exist until Cat wills it. Same story for the world itself. Doesn't really exist unless Cat initiates the program. This is crazy. This is crazy. The program? The world machine. A universe simulator that runs on Cat's computer. We are all in it right now. So we're not real? Oh, you are. Which is why you're so important. The biggest flaw of the program is that it cannot be run independently. It requires the mental processing abilities of a real person from another universe. Think of it like one of your dreams. When you wake up, it's gone. But unlike a dream, this world has a physical location inside a computer, which Cat operates. For this world to continue existing without you, around you, sorry, Cat <laughs> has to be in constant contact with you. If Cat ends the program, the world will go into a stasis. Guys, does Cat know this? From Cat's perspective, the world machine isn't all that special. It's no different from other rec recreational game type software they may have installed on their computer. This is nuts. <laughs> they can also regenerate the world as many times as they'd like, now that the resurrection is nullified. All of that is consistent with their concept of what a computer game looks like. What am I even supposed to save if everything is just... fake? Fake is a harsh word, but... And... Why... did Cat never tell me anything about any of this? Is this why it feels like I haven't been home for so long? Once you've established a mental link with the world, you cannot break it unless the world is saved. But at this point, the world can never be truly saved. Why would you make a world that's doomed from the beginning? Why do you keep bringing me back to it? Cat, aren't you supposed to be a kind god? It appears that we have some confusion here. Cat did not build the world. Cat only owns a machine that is able to generate the world from pre-existing code. This is crazy. My mind is blowing up. They actually have fairly limited control of the events. The world was built by someone else altogether. Someone you cannot begin to fathom. It was also not designed to be the futile quest that it is now, but too many things went wrong. There's a type of signal disruption that he never expected. It's eating away at the world slowly, rendering it into an unrecognizable mess. Oh, that's the glitch stuff! Even if you bring back the sun, it will not go away. Square stuff. Isn't it? I remember those from before. Then you know what to watch out for. The creator knows what might be causing it, but there is nothing that he could do until now. You managed to find me after all. You being here was due to his help. Oh? I guess it has something to do with the journal? Looks like he wants to have one final attempt at fixing it, and he might need to do it through you. Nico, do you remember how to get to the Glen? Whatever you did in your last session, you should stick with it now. The creator is mobilizing things, throwing everything into this one last shot. There might not be enough internal resources left for Cat to be able to generate another session after this. I will meet you at the docks later. Punching the developer in the face. I really hope that it ends with us punching the developer in the face. Um, that'd be great. So now we just, oh wait, shit. Hey, you okay in there? I did what I could with the terminals for now and... Shit. It's you. You're the robot that insisted on living in the mines. 
Are you not? My friend told me to keep an eye out for you, should we ever cross paths. Your friend gave you something the last time you saw each other. Can you show me what it is? Wait, you know about the amber? I just asked to see it, didn't I? I needed it to fix a robot, so she gave it to me. Here, see? Ah, he seemed to trust you, so I'll treat you as an ally as well. Okay, please listen carefully. You need to escort the Messiah for the remainder of the Barons. I predict a high concentration of square particle disruptions in the near future. It's likely that structures in the vicinity of the Messiah might be affected, making it a far more treacherous pilgrimage than the previous er, uh, expectations. Cat and the Messiah need all the extra help that they can get right now. Come on, I'll wait for you outside. Wait, I want to ask you. If you were going to ask her about being not real, save your breath. None of the people here know their predicament. In fact, I don't think they can even comprehend it. It would be in your best interest to just pretend like we never had this conversation. What about you? I was thinking the same thing, Nico. How did you know? We never had this conversation, remember? 